Hey there everybody, we're back with another video. In today's video, we're gonna show you how to replace the battery for the iPhone X. Uh, as you can see here, we already have it on our heating pad. Uh, it's been heating up for about two, three minutes. Uh, it's perfectly fine, this is a nice even heat. Uh, so we're just gonna go ahead. The issue with this battery is actually it's going bad. Uh, so the customer has been saying that it's been draining really quickly. Uh, and as you can see here on the side, uh, the screen is actually lifted up a little bit due to the battery inside. Uh, expanding uh, over time the batteries do lose you know a little bit of their juice uh, it's essentially a battery that goes bad over time uh, so we're just gonna go ahead and start off by removing the bottom screws right here it's just two of them so be sure that you put them somewhere where you know they're gonna be at and since we already went ahead and preheated it a little bit it should make the screen uh, come off a little bit easier uh, so just grab a pry tool, go along the edges, don't go all the way in. Uh, you just need a little bit of the pry tool in there. And just gently, gently pry up on the edges. Once that's done, you're able to open up the phone. The phone opens to the right. Uh, and be sure to hold your screen open to a 90 degree angle. If you go any further than that, you could tear... Uh, some connectors to the screen uh, and you're gonna have to do more of a process of fixing the phone than expected So as you can see here the battery is very swollen uh, like I said over time they do degrade so this is something common that happens and They can potentially be dangerous uh, if it is left like that so we're just going to go ahead and start off by removing these screws here to the bracket that holds down all these connectors. Uh, these screws, it is important that you put them back in the correct order that you're taking them out. Uh, because if you do not, uh, it could potentially damage something else inside of the phone. All right, and once we have our bracket taken off, now you can see all these connectors uh, that are going to be right here. Uh, some of them are going to include your screen connectors. We're going to go ahead and disconnect the battery so we could go ahead and start removing it. Now, since we've already had the battery uh, preheat up a little bit, the adhesive underneath it should be pretty nice and loose. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and go in with a pry tool. Uh, you could use anything like a playing card, a business card, something that's nice and rigid. Uh, and if you'd like, also to make it a little bit more easier, you can use some rubbing alcohol. So like I said, it should already be loose uh, thanks to preheating it up. You could preheat it up yourself with uh, a hot air gun. You could also use a blow dryer, like a hair dryer, uh, so that way you can go ahead and remove it. And there we go. Battery's coming out. Remember, it's also important uh, whenever you are taking it off, be sure that you're very careful around it. Uh, if you do puncture the battery, uh, it can potentially cause a fire. So now we've already gone ahead. Uh, be sure to remove all the old adhesive. The batteries uh, already come with a new adhesive. So just line everything up. Make sure the connector goes in where it's supposed to be connected. And there we go. We're just going to go ahead and follow all the steps back uh, by placing the brackets and the screws back. Uh, now, it looks like a simple repair. Uh, if you are interested in getting it done, you can come down. We have three locations throughout the valley. Uh, or if you are within any of the 50 states of the U.S., you can go ahead. There is a link down in the description uh, that you can click and you can send it to us. So that way we can repair it for you. So here, like I said, we're just going to be putting on the bracket again uh, and the screws, uh, the same order that we took them off, we're going to be putting them back on. All right, once that's done, you can go ahead, just make sure that everything is where it's supposed to go. Line up your screen. And along the edges, just firmly press 
down so that way it snaps into place. After that, don't forget to put in your bottom screws that hold it down. These are both the same size so you don't have to worry about what screw goes in where. So as you can see here, the screen is now flush with the frame of the phone uh, and that's thanks to the new battery being in there. The old battery was causing it to puff up and out. Uh, so yeah, with the new battery, now it's 100% it's flush. And now we're going to go ahead and we're going to leave our phone number right here. If you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call. We're more than happy to help. All right. And now just so you guys can see that it is a brand new battery, we're going to be going to the settings. And as you can see here, the maximum capacity is at 100%.